Morning, buddy. Skyler and I are go down and check on the animals. Got some feed to take down there. It's too wet to get the fuller out. Take the feed down there and I don't feel like carry it all so I'm gonna get a little cart and roll it down there. The chickens hear me coming. I think chickens are worse than the dogs through coming through the gate. I left that gate open for, if I sound like I'm out of breath, I left that gate open for, I mean, literally 30 seconds. And they came across here and came out and were trying to get out outside. And the problem is, is the new chickens that we have, if they get out, like our older chickens, They'll stay pretty close, but those newer ones, they'll get out in the road and down the road. We had we had neighbors and stuff stop and say, hey, your chickens are down the road. I don't want them to get run over or something. I'm gonna show y'all something here. We uh, picked up some feed on uh, oh, the other night while we were out and about. This sweet feed's what we've been feeding a pig. These are layer pellets here. Also picked up some peach trees we need to put in the ground. But this bag of layer feed, I know, I know, the whole producer's pride um, saga. Uh, we feed our, and have fed our chickens producer's pride for a long time and have had no issues with them laying eggs. In fact, uh, we've said this before, they're laying better this year than they have probably ever. So anyway, this bag at Tractor Supply, uh, Shanna found it and it was open. And in reality, I don't think it lost any feed out of it at all. But if it did, it was not more than a pound or two out of a 40 pound bag and Shanna found one of the kids that was working there and said, hey, this bag's open. Will y'all uh, give it to me at a discount? 50% off. So we got that bag for half price. And they're going for about $14 a bag now. So that's uh, $14, $15, something like that. So, you know, six or seven bucks, seven, eight bucks, something like that. Um, and really got almost a full bag of feed. So uh, anytime, if you go into Tractor Supply or even your local feed store, First thing, if you'll ask them, hey, do you have any broken bags for sale? They'll tell you if they do. Sometimes they have broken ones, sometimes they have ones that have gotten wet, um, you know, that they'll discount you a, a couple bucks or maybe even like in that situation, 50%. So right now with the uh, feed prices, the way they are, you know, everything's high, but a few bucks is better than nothing, so. boys are out here last night with one of their buddies neighbor kids and they were having a movie night I think we're watching 13 hours in Benghazi the boys are they're at that age where they're into police and firefighter and you know war type movies and stuff that's a good movie though all right I'll get this feed down there Go sneaking through there again. But they're all sitting here. If I, that's a big red. She's already going for it. Look at her.
sometimes when you're <clears throat> doing chores by yourself you gotta keep creative see if that stays in there while I fill the water up always a kink Working so far. I don't hear the water running anymore, so it's almost full. It worked. It is a nasty, dreary day. It's supposed to burn off in a few hours. I'm talking about going fishing, but I don't know. It's already about 11 o'clock, so we'll see. got water she had water before but she's got full water now y'all can tell if you're new to the channel her pin goes back on the other side of this building and makes a big kind of a flag shape flagpole shape this is a smaller part of the pin here she's about to tear up her shelter we built her we I put it back together a few times but she's just getting so big she's just just tearing it apart she uh has also been rooting a lot which is what most pigs do somebody in a recent video uh, said something about putting a ring in her nose to keep her from rooting got it i guess y'all you could do that you know put a ring in her nose i don't know we've never done that before uh you know Pigs just root. That's just part of it. Uh, at some point, uh, you know, plan on getting her pen a little more, uh, or, or the pen we raise our pigs in, a little more uh, beefed up with cattle panels and more T-posts and whatnot. Uh, but I don't really want to stop her from rooting. Like I said, that's what she wants to do. So she's got to keep her from getting out. Well, uh, as we showed y'all recently, we uh, picked up a bunch of materials. We're fixing to start doing some projects here at the house, um, on the house here. Uh, and I was gonna start replacing some of the siding on the front of the house there today. But then I looked at the dang weather app and it's supposed to storm tonight. So, which means I got five sheets I need to replace there. So if I start on it today, I'd have to get it all finished today. And it's kind of late in the day to get that project going so uh said thinking about going fishing but if it doesn't if this doesn't burn off and uh, doesn't warm up a little bit i don't i don't know that the fishing's going to be great either so and it was supposed to already burn off uh, a couple hours ago so i don't know i'm gonna go inside and uh probably do some editing and stuff and kind of hang out and see what it does so
my uh, camera, you might want to back up a little bit. Hey, catch this. This is one way to kill ants. Catch this. Hopefully they're not on me now. That's one way to get ants on you. Mm hmm. Might have killed a couple. dark up there. It's like, it's gonna be like that video I watched where it's like, it's like, um, I think it's getting a little dark and then it shows the next one be like walking in rain. Hmm. Hmm? No, I'm good. I just made y'all something. All right, y'all. We'll catch y'all later. Uh, if you haven't already, uh, thank y'all for watching. Uh, thank you for participating on our videos, commenting. Uh, thumbs ups, all that stuff. We appreciate it. Uh, we'll see you all again.